All right, what's going on everybody? This is the advanced inline Y drill. I don't really have a name for it. I literally just made it up on the fly. We've got Quinn here. Um, we've got Jill throwing for us and I'm going to teach you a thing or two. But first, please click subscribe. I appreciate it very much. If you enjoy the video at the end of it, give it a thumbs up. You know the drill. If you don't like the video, find someone else's video to click a thumbs down on. But uh, if you enjoyed, if you got questions, leave a comment. I appreciate it very much. Um, this drill is teaching depth perception and pinpoint marking, okay? So in theory, I'm going to have, be standing here and Jill is right now roughly 50, 40, 50 yards away. And the first throw is gonna be angled in. Then she's gonna throw one flat. Then she's gonna throw one angle back. And the dog's gonna pick up this one, this one, and this one. We're gonna use orange bumpers. Let me remind Jill. Orange bumpers, my friend, thank you. Orange bumpers, with a younger dog, you'd use white bumpers or a duck, but because Quinn e 10 10 is a little more advanced. We're gonna do orange bumpers. It's gonna increase the difficulty of pinpoint marking, okay? Uh, once she does the angle in, flat angle back, she's gonna drive 20, 30 yards further in line, angle in, flat back. Then she's gonna drive 20 or 30 yards further, angle in, flat and back. And so if you think about that, when you look through the field, and we're gonna get an aerial picture, the dog's gonna have to run through old falls, run under the arc, all that jazz, and pinpoint accuracy marking. I don't do this one too often, but it's a good one to have in the toolbox. All right, here we go. Sit down. Angle in. Quinn. Beauty. Now we're gonna go flat. Here, here, Quinn. Heel, heel, sit, sit, good. Quinn. Ooh, broke down just a hair and got it. Cool. So that's kind of what we're gonna see here is them try and break down a little early and learn to pinpoint accuracy, pick up their bird. Um, if they screw up, I'm just gonna have Jill help them out just a little hair, a uh, little bit with like maybe a hey, hey, or a, a step. Sit. This is our angle back. Quinn. She's running through the old fall. She's actually about to cross a little bit of a road. Got to dig back. Hunting, hunting, hunting. Hunting, 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 hunting. Hey, there you go. All right, Jill, drive about 20 or 30 yards. Here, girl. This is a cool little drill, heel. It's similar to our Y drill. That's why I don't have a name for it. I just called it the advanced Y drill. Here, set, good. Angle, angle in. So now this is gonna kinda land in a funny way from where she just picked one up. Quinn. Looking good, looking good. Go to the area. Find your bumper. Hunting, hunting. And what I'd like to see, because right now she's putting on a big hunt, what I'd like to see is as we go through this, the intensity of the fall area is going to increase and she's going to be more precise. And instead of running around like a chicken with her head cut off. Doot, doot, doot. 
Gotta love when they don't do it great for your video. But this is what it looks like when you train dogs. Help her out, Jill. Help her out. She is way out in the left field. Good. Actually, that wasn't good, but that's fine. All right, this is going to be our flat throw. Heel. Set. Set. Quinn. I want that precision marking. Pick up a bumper and do better. Like that. a girl, good. Now we're going to angle back. Do, 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 do. Here. Heel. Set. Good. Quinn. Gotta stroke my mustache for good luck that she picks this mark up nicely. Hey, there you go. All right, now listen. She screwed up one of these marks. All right, drive 20 yards further there, Jill. She screwed up that one mark. What is cool is the two following marks. Heel. She hammered. Now, I don't know why, but my thought is they don't want to hunt their guts out. They want to go get their bird. And so maybe she's starting to say, hey, I need to really focus a little bit more here. And that's what I want. Here we go. Angle in. Quinn. She's got a good line on this one. The other reason we're using orange bumpers is dogs are like deer. They don't see orange like we do. So it blends in a lot more. If we were to use white bumpers, she probably wouldn't be putting on so much of a hunt. Um, and if we use ducks, she'd be smelling them really well when she's in that area. So she's got to be more precise with the orange bumper. There you go, good. The other thing is with an angle in throw, it's awkward. Over the course of their life, so many throws are flat and angle back that they run to that area of the gun and know it's gonna be there. So when you throw an angle in, they really gotta be precise. Here, here, here. Good, set. This is our flat throw. Quinn. Running through all these old falls, depth perception, pinpoint accuracy marking. Right, getting close. I want our hunt to be a little bit tighter too, which is also why we do a drill like this. Hey, there you go, girl, good. So instead of making big loops and running around, I wanna know that, hey, I'm in this area, I'm gonna stick it out in this area and dig it out. All right, this is our last bird for this drill, our angle back, here, set. Set. Quinn. And I have seen an increase in intensity and ability to go straight to that fall area on each one of these marks after she had that big goofy hunt where Jill had to kind of hey hey and get her back in the area. So I'm pleased with that. And it's neat for you to see a, a dog kind of screw it up, not just go out and step on every mark. Come on, girl, get out there. So again, things for this drill that I'm thinking of, depth perception, pinpoint accuracy. For younger dogs, you can use white bumpers or ducks. For older dogs, the orange bumpers are clutch. I like using the three inch bumpers. I don't like throwing the, the little guys. Um, again, if you enjoyed this video, I appreciate you tuning in. So do me a big solid. Click subscribe, give it a thumbs up, Hop. hey, hey, and we'll see you in the next video. Adios. Atta girl.